22 young men and women gave their oath today to serve their country as part of the United States Navy. They all say they came in for different reasons, but they all want to serve one purpose. It's exciting. Um, definitely it feels like an honor. It's a privilege to um, have this bestowed upon us, and it's also very anxious and nervous feelings. They traveled from across the state to be sworn into the United States Navy by Vice Admiral Jeffrey Tressler. Vice Admiral Jeffrey Tressler says starting today, these new recruits lives will be changed forever. They took an oath to the Constitution. That's something not brought out uh, much when we uh, have these events or maybe not recognized and not to a person, not to an organization, but to the Constitution of the United States of America. Each recruit says they are looking forward to serving, whether that's as a Navy SEAL, air traffic controller, or some other area. I'm going into CTT, which is clipped logic technician, so just putting my all into that and just like getting in what I put into the Navy and seeing where it goes from there. Within the ceremony, the United States Navy representatives from Oklahoma received legislation declaring this week officially Navy Week in the state, bringing more awareness to the hard work these men and women do on a daily basis. Now these new sailors are headed to boot camp to begin their training.